Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Don't you run, don't you hide. Mommy knows what's in your mind. You're a freak just like me. perfect mom coming to meet you. Really? Okay, Molly, don't blow this by being yourself. What? I think I'm great at being myself. Uh-huh, sure you are. Actually, you both should be yourself, because if you're going to be a perfect family, then you need to be yourselves. Everybody, moms, dads, kids. That way you know if you're a good fit for one another. Okay, Mr. Smith. Well, where's this mom? She should be here any minute. I can't wait. I can't wait. Finally, we're going to get adopted, Daisy. Finally. Hi. What's up? I just got to run around the block a few times. <sighs> I haven't gotten in 10 miles yet today. <sighs> uh, is she the real right now? Yeah. Whoa, she's buff. Look at the muscles on her. Okay, so how many jumping jacks can you do? Um, let me see. Uh, one, two, uh, three. Uh, I can only do four. Ah, uh, they're not going to make star athletes. I don't want them. Seriously? We, that was the interview? It's over? Yep. I need to find star athletes. Bye. Oh, man, Daisy. We missed out on the mom we thought we were going to have. Well, girls, I have another mom coming to meet you today. Oh, boy. Hopefully she's better than the last. Uh, yeah, I'm just here to see if I want to adopt some kids. Yeah, I know, but, like, they could carry my shopping bags and stuff. Ooh, she likes to go shopping. She sounds like a perfect mom. Uh, Daisy, she sounds kind of mean and rude. 
Excuse me, uh, yeah, I have to go because I'm trying to see if I'm gonna adopt these babies. Ugh, my friend just talks and talks and talks. Hi, I'm Karen, what are your names? I'm Molly. And I'm Daisy. Hi, I'm Mr. Smith and no one cares who you are. I'm not adopting you, jeez. Oh, well, it's customary that you didn't even have signal in here. How am I supposed to shop my favorite stores? All right, so um, get in the van and you can come with me and carry my shopping bags. Oh, cool. Do we get to eat lunch out? No, you don't get to eat lunch. I'm the only one that gets to eat lunch out. I have money for all of us to eat out. Um, I'm thinking that maybe you're not the mom for us. Yeah, uh, pass. Are you girls sure? No one else has come in to see you guys and pass! Oh boy, do we have anyone else to see us today? I just give up. All the moms have been terrible. Okay then, well that's great because today I have a dad! Really? A dad? Okay, let's see him. I want to meet him. Hey, oh man, good thing I got two groupies right here. Cause I have a gig tonight and like my drummist quit and also my bassist. I mean my drummer, did I say drummist? <laughs> oh man, I don't get enough sleep cause like during the day I work at Kinko's so I can afford these sweet guitars. And then at night I'm out to like three o'clock in the morning playing my band's gigs. So can you play drums? Can you play bass? Uh, yeah, sure, I'm sure I can. You cannot, Molly. You're terrible at musical instruments. Uh, no, we can't. Okay, then. Well, I don't get to adopt you, I guess. So long. Good luck with your life. Oh, man. We're never going to get adopted. Never. Girls, why don't you go play at the park for a while? You look like you could use some cheering up. Yeah, you could save that again. I feel so sad. Hey, wait, what's this flyer for? What is it, Molly? It says it's for a new adoption center and that they could get us a, a brand new mom or dad. That's amazing. Um, hold on. I'm, I'm going to call the number. Daisy, it's ringing. Whoa, Molly, your phone looks gigantic. You need to get with the program. Phones aren't that big anymore. Um, it's an old phone. It's all I could get. I'm an orphan. I can't afford the latest iPhone. Sorry. Oh, well, maybe you should get a job. Daisy! Too little to get a job. It's ringing. Hello. What can I do for you? You've reached the new adoption center. Oh, hi. My name's Molly. My sister's name is Daisy. We're at the Brookhaven Adoption Center, and we can't seem to find a good mom or dad. Do you think you could help us? Oh, I'd love to help you. Come to the next town over and look for the sign that says Playtime Co. We'll help you get adopted. We promise. Sounds good. Bye. Daisy, we're going to a new adoption center. Oh, Daisy, look at this place. Molly, this doesn't look like an adoption center. This looks like a factory. I don't know. It looks amazing. Let's go inside. Molly, I don't know. Something about it's giving me the creeps. Nonsense. This adoption center is going to be amazing. Whoa. It looks like it's a old toy factory. Woohoo! I never had any of my toys of my own. I always had to share the ones at the adoption center and they had holes in them and somebody bit the ear off the teddy bear. And, and it, 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 I'm just tired of never having a new toy myself. Maybe I could find one here. Molly, I don't know. Uh, this, I don't know. Something about it seems not right. Oh, look, there's a toy now. Oh, it's so cute. Where is everybody, though? Doesn't seem like anybody works here. Exactly, Molly. I think this might have been, well, a, a, a trap. Look at this. You can go through the vent. I'm going down there. Molly, don't. Okay, fine. Oh, you're such a goody two-shoes. Let's go back to the regular adoption center. Let's not say we did. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Like a huggy wuggy doll. I've never heard of that before. That's because these toys are not normal toys. I mean, does that say booger bot? No, it says boogie bot. Booger bot. <laughs> Daisy booger bot. Whatever. Wait, does that say soup so poops a lot? Uh, yeah, that's probably right. I think I heard a commercial for that. Hmm, what's in here?
Wow. Look at this. This is where they test the toys. Wow. Welcome. Who is that, Marley? I don't know. It sounds like it came over the intercom speaker. Hi. Why don't you come into the cafeteria? Mommy has some snacks. Did she say mommy? Yeah, maybe she wants to be our mom. It seems pretty nice to be our mom. I mean, right? We need a mom, don't we? Molly, I don't like this. I have a feeling in my gut. And my gut feeling's never wrong. I'm going. La, 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 Ew, is that an ant? Gross. Well, hello. Ah! Ah! Oh, my God, it's a giant pink spider. What is that? Hi, I'm Mommy. Um, we're going to be leaving now because you're creepy looking. No, no one's going to go anywhere. Oh, excuse the cockroaches. <laughs> I haven't had time to clean. Ah, Molly! Oh my gosh, she's creepy! Don't think you're going anywhere. I'm adopting you. Um, lady? Or spider? Or a creepy toy doll thing? You're not adopting us! Come back here. I don't like naughty children. You're going to get a timeout. Daisy? Daisy? Marty, shh. I need to hide. I need to hide too. I want this open. You're going to get a timeout. Oh, my God. I don't want a timeout. Timeouts are awful. Okay, I think I can escape through this vent. Oh, my gosh. I'm too fat to fit through there. Oh, there you are, Daisy. Don't you want me to be your mommy? No, we don't want you to be our mommy. You creepy, creepy. Oh my God, I accidentally walked into her. Get into my web. It's a nice place to be. Ah, no, get away from me. Fire, Daisy. Hold it right there. Get away from my sister, creepy. What? You've got the crab pack. Oh my gosh. No, please no. Yeah, that's right, crazy. That'll teach you for trying to adopt us good kids. No! No! Come on, Molly! Let's make a run for it! Good idea, but how do we get out of this huge place? Just go out the front door! Oh yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so we've got to definitely report her to the police. This place is not an adoption center! Not even close. That mommy long legs. She's psycho! I love playing outside. It's so fun. Huggy, get in here. I need your help. Oh, no. My dad wants me to help him with another science experiment. I better get inside before I get a timeout. Huggy, Buggy was a blue fuzzy fuzzy. Where have you been, Huggy? We have a lot of work to get done. Sorry, Dad. I just wanted some fresh air. You're a monster. You don't need fresh air. You need to stick to the task. And we have to create a lot of monster toys in here. Okay. It just makes me feel really sad when I'm always stuck in here working. I didn't create you to have fun. You are to be my evil monster. So wipe that smile off your face, Huggy Wuggy. Okay, sorry. Dad, do you want to have some cake at lunch? No, I don't want to have any cake. I don't even want to have lunch. And quit calling me dad. I'm the creator. And you're a baby huggy wuggy monster. Okay, no cake and I will call you dad. Now, today we are going to be creating a new kind of monster. An evil monster. The most evil monster ever. Hey dad, what's this do? Don't touch that! You're, you're gonna mess up everything! Oh, sorry! What's it do, though? Huggy! I told you not to touch that! Oh, you ruined everything! You're a very dumb monster! Well, that isn't very nice. I was just curious. Ah, help me create this new, better, evil monster! Wait, better than you, Huggy. Okay. I don't feel very happy. Is she done yet? No, she's not done. Stop asking me. Okay, okay, okay. But is she done yet? No, 
Baby Huggy, you are the dumbest monster in the world! I already told you one second ago, she's not done yet! Okay, sorry, I keep asking. She just looks done to me. So what happens if I push this button? Huggy! No! She's gigantic! I was gonna rearrange her so that she was smaller. Now she has a child's brain and, 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 and a grown-up body! Oh my gosh, she could destroy the world! Wait a minute, she could destroy the world. <coughs> that might not be such a bad thing. Well, maybe I did something right, huh, Dad? Baby Huggy, stop calling me your dad! I'm the creator. <laughs> I gotta go see the new monster. She cute. Huggy Wuggy, we have to try to pass her off as as a normal baby. I'll have to I'll have to give her some sort of serum to make her smaller, and then we'll put her in Brookhaven. <laughs> Someone will adopt her at the adoption center, <laughs> and then she'll grow up and take over the world. Oh. You sound a little crazy, Dad. Should I push the button now? Yes, Huggy Wuggy, push the button so we can make her small. Then we can ship her to Brookhaven Adoption Center. <laughs> okay, wait, which button was it again? Oh, baby Huggy Wuggy, you're so dumb. My plan worked perfectly. Well, you messed it up a little, baby Huggy Wuggy, but... <laughs> She's all boxed up and ready to go to Brookhaven. I'm gonna miss baby Longlegs. She was so cute. Jared and Brianna, I need you guys to be good. I'm gonna go get the mail out front, okay? Okay, we'll just stay here and play. I really hope that someone adopts us today, Jared. Me too, Brianna. I'm sick of living at the adoption center. I want a mommy or a daddy or a mommy and a daddy. I don't care who adopts me. It could be a cat, as long as somebody adopts me. <laughs> I don't think a cat would be a very good mom. Look at this. I got a really strange box. It says playtime on it. <coughs> um, I think that there's somebody inside the box. Oh my gosh. I think there might be a baby inside the box. It's a... It's a... Do you? Yeah, I love flies and I'm starving. Give me some. Oh, I think you might be a monster. Wait, what? No, I'm not a monster. Um, well, it's not your fault that you want to eat flies. I'll go get you some. But first I have to go outside and see if I can catch some. Wow, this place seems kind of nice. I guess I could live here until someone adopts me. Oh boy, here comes my food. Ew, what's that? A burrito? I don't want burrito. Don't worry, Marlena. <laughs> You're gonna love this. I got it from the dumpster, so it's covered in flies. 
flies. <laughs> Maybe he's like a frog or an ugly spider or something. <laughs> I'm gonna call her Marlena Longlegs. <laughs> what? No, I'm not. I'm just different than you, but I'm not mean or anything or weird. No, you're definitely weird. No one's gonna adopt you. Okay, that's enough, Jared. Maybe he's right. Maybe no one really will adopt me. Mm. These flies are pretty good. That's exactly why no one's gonna adopt me, not ever. Because I'm Marlena Longlegs. <laughs> okay, Marlena, it's time for nap time. Why don't you lay down and take a nice night night? Okay. Oh, thank goodness she's gone. I can't stay here another minute. Those kids are so mean. I'm gonna get out of here. I've got to find somewhere that will love a monster like me. Uh, I'm still hungry. Let me see what I can find in this dumpster. Mmm, another fly burrito. Mm. Whoa, I feel like I'm growing bigger. I am growing bigger. Why am I growing bigger so fast? The other kids aren't growing this big this fast. Who's gonna wanna adopt me now? I'm getting so big. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a grown-up pretty soon and nobody will want me because um, everybody just wants to adopt cute little babies. Oh. <laughs> I need to find a mom and a dad really fast. Oh my gosh, I've been walking such a long time and I'm all grown up now. Oh, too bad I didn't find a mom or a dad. I still want to have a family, and everyone in Brookhaven is human. I don't fit in there, not even one little bit. Ooh, what's this place? Playtime Co? Hmm, it seems I came from there originally. Maybe there's monsters there just like me. Hello, is anybody home? Oh, it seems to be abandoned. <laughs> What's that sound? Oh, hello, little monster. Hello, my daddy. He abandoned me. Oh, no. I never had a family. I think that I was shipped from here, though. Wait a minute. Are you... Are you baby long legs? Wow, you grew up very fast. Oh, do I know you? Yeah, I helped Daddy make you because he makes all the monsters at Playtime Co. What's your name? Oh, I'm Marlena. But everyone in Brookhaven called me Marlena Longlegs. Oh, I wish my dad would come back. I miss him. Well, maybe I could be your mommy. You could call me Mommy Longlegs. Really? Would you love me and hug me and take care of me? Sure I would. I always wanted my own family. Oh, who needs a hug? Oh, I could use a hug. Oh, Mommy, you're so nice. Oh, baby, I finally have my own family. And those humans in Brookhaven will pay for making me feel like a weirdo. Whoa, I think that's a great idea. 